हेलो गाइस मैं सेल्फ जपनूर कौर स्टडिंग इन सिक्स जी टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू प्रेजेंट ऑन द टॉपिक क्लोजर प्रॉपर्टीज आई नो दिस इज अ न्यू वर्ड फॉर यू फर्स्ट वी विल नो अबाउट द डेफिनेशन ऑफ क्लोजर प्रॉपर्टीज टू होल नंबर्स एड अप टू गिव अनदर होल नंबर दिस इज द क्लोजर प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ द होल नंबर्स इट मीन्स दैट द होल नंबर्स आर Closed under addition, if a and b are two whole numbers and a plus b is equal to c, then c is also a whole number. Are you confused? Don't worry. I will give you an example. For example, four plus three is equal to seven. Four and three are whole numbers, so that sum we will get that would be also a whole number. Now I will give some information about closure property under subtraction. When one whole number is subtracted from another, the difference is not always a whole number. This means that the whole numbers are not closed under subtraction. For example, seven minus five is equal to two. These all are whole numbers. But if we will do five minus seven. Is equal to minus two. In this situation, minus two is not a whole number. Now we have come to the next closure property. That is the closure property of the property of closure for multiplication states that for certain sets of numbers, when you multiply two or are more numbers in that set, you will get a result. that is also in that set now i think you have understood this section of property for more understanding i will give you a hint for example 5 multiplied by 3 is equal to 15 the 5 is a whole number 3 is a whole number so the answer we will get it will be also a whole number I think you all know about division now I am sure that you will also understand the concept of closure property under division if the division of two numbers from a set always produces a number in the set we have closure under division the set of whole numbers are not closed division and the set of integers are not closed under division because they both produce fractions now i will explain you with an example for example 8 divided by 4 is equal to 2 whereas these all are whole numbers so result is also a whole number but if in the case of divided by 7 then we get the result as 5 div upon 7 therefore 5 upon 7 is not a whole number as it is in fractions now i think you all are clear with closure properties thank you everyone stay home and stay safe